Friday, February 2nd, 2024. I don't know what all of the groundhogs around the country uh, saw today, uh, but I'm already over winter, so let's just hope it is mild from here on out. Um, but the view today <laughs> was kind of a shit show um, in in uh, hilarity. Um, boy, when Joy gets mad, it is something else. Um, it started with a discussion about uh, Joe Biden's penchant for swearing. I don't know why this is even a discussion. Um, but yeah, sure. Uh, he should let out moments like that uh, more often. He, um, you know, the more uh, relatable he is, the better. Um, and the more, the less robotic he is, the better. Um, and uh, of course, Amy Lucifer, Farrell Griffin has to like, but his poll numbers are so bad in the swing states. And he's just, you know what, lady, if you're like anybody but Trump, like never let Trump, well, I mean, she isn't anybody let Trump. She is do whatever we can to make sure Trump doesn't get in office. Then you know what? You need to get on team Biden because it, all of this whinging and all this other crap you're doing isn't helping um, and I, I don't think you understand what um, never letting Trump in again actually means for you as a person and what you have to do to, to achieve that. Um, you can, you know, throw up all the flags you want about how awful Trump is, but you actually have to succeed in beating him. And the only one that can beat him is his only opponent. <laughs> anyway, so that's a frustrating, but then uh, they did a story about Larry David attacking Elmo on uh, um, on the Today Show. And oh my God. Joy, of course, is just going to defend the comedian um, and kept calling Elmo a puppet, um, which angered, annoyed Sarah, um, insisting that he's a Muppet. I don't know technically the difference of what the difference is between a Muppet and a puppet, because um, I, I assumed a Muppet was a made up word by Jim Henson, but I have no idea. Um, anyway, so, uh, and then the discussion and Joy had no clue that, you know, in 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 what Elmo sort of represents. Um, and Elmo is the more famous one on that, uh, of the two of them. It, he's definitely got a higher exposure than Larry David. Um, and just the, and Joy kept getting more and more angry every, Sonny was the only one to back her up to say, you know, it's a joke, you know, people need to, um, you know, back off on, uh, on, you know, to have a sense of humor. But Alyssa and Sarah are actually right. It, it, I mean, when I was a kid, that Good Morning America was on TV. That's, that's just what we watched before, you know, it was on the TV before we went to school. We literally ate our cereal and, you know, got ready. Um, so, uh, <laughs> when Joy is like, Alyssa, what six-year-old is watching the Today Show? Like a lot of them, because that's what's on in the house um, or apartment. Um, but uh, she just, Joy just lost her marbles and insisted on and continuing to say, it's a puppet, it's a puppet, until Sarah literally screamed, he's a muppet. I thought Anna was going to haul off and hit her. She was like, do not scream in my ear. <laughs> it was kind of chaos. And Joy was like, she was fuming about this whole topic. Um, but you know what? I, it, I'm sorry, Larry David. You are the less famous one. And you know what? It wasn't funny. What was the point of going up and strangling Elmo? I don't, I, I, I don't get it. I don't, I don't like his humor. I don't like that program he's on. Um, I don't want to see a show about, you know, some cranky old man who creates his own problems by complaining about everything. Like, it's just, no. And, and some, like, egocentric and, uh, you know, the world revolves around his perspective. I'm just not interested. Um, that's, we have enough of that. I don't need to choose to participate um, for a half an hour a week or however long that program is. Fuck you, Larry David. Um and, you know, I don't know that there was any kind of strategy involved from his standpoint. I think he's just a cranky old man. He's like, that voice annoys the shit out of me. Um, I want to shut it up. But you know what? It's not your show. Sit down and wait your turn. Ugh. Anyway.
um, other than that, uh, Jack Whitehall is adorable um, and very funny. I, like he seems like, uh, it, you know, I like someone who um, is into the stories that they're going to tell. It's really, um, uh, you know, it, it's just boring to hear someone throw out their, you know, their media training and the, and the catchphrases that they've um, come up with uh, to describe whatever they're going to talk about. Um, and actually like, just, you know, be engaged in, uh, in the stories that they're telling. Um, he's a hoot. And I didn't even know he had that show with his dad, which now I have to watch, um, which I guess I can do over the weekend because it's still winter. <laughs>